All right. Oh, let me rest reset my capture card. It's the audio is a bit desynced on my end. One moment. One moment. I don't know how why the audio falls a bit out of sync. But I'd rather have it on my end than the stream's end, and it's pretty quick to fix, so. No biggie. It's because I was playing Dynasty Warriors all day, dude. I finished every mission in story mode, so now I'm on to ambition mode, which is like smaller missions. It's fun. It's a change of pace. Okay. Oh, what should I get up to today? Well, in honor of uh, Hina, who's now doomed, I'll play the character in this game that he would like. Because we haven't even done her prologue yet. We know nothing about you, Yuki. Cool. What do you got? This must First be day it. at a new school. Of course, the track room's all the way in the back. Yo, she look. She walks so angrily, dude. Or maybe not angrily, just with purpose. Oh. Aggressively. <laughs> like you know, not to mess with her. No way, Yuki-chan. You got tall, Nachan. Your hair's so long, Yuki-chan. I almost didn't recognize you. You're the one who told me to grow it out. Remember? That's right. You stopped writing back to me. I was worried, you know. Yeah, sorry. A lot of things happened after the move. But I just got transferred here. Today's my first day. Really? I knew you went to this school too. Figured I'd find you eventually. It's good to see your face again. Though, I never took you for a track girl. <laughs> oh, there's so many things I want to talk to you about. Aren't you in the middle of practice right now? Well, hey, buddy. I've got to get somewhere, too. But now, we can see each other anytime. Totally. Keep working hard, Nachan. You know Dr. it. Dr. Space. Later. Yuki-chan, so you're finally here. Thanks, Shu. Nachan, my childhood friend. We went our separate ways in middle school, but we still kept writing to each other. She's the only person I really care about. Don't call me that. Oh. I don't like being called by my name. But I just heard... I didn't ask your opinion. Shut up. <laughs> it's fine if it's her. Uh, you remember me, right? I don't know. Who are you again? How about the guy you were destined to meet? More like a random guy I bumped into in the shopping district. Don't get all weird about it. Aw, you're so cruel, Yuki-chan. I said quit calling me that. Dude, she's gonna beat him up. Hey, I'm Iguchi. I've been looking for you. Ah, Nenji Ogata. The hell? Well, well, well. If it isn't Takami of Suzu High. What are you doing on our turf? Not trying to stake a claim, are you? She just transferred here, actually. Some flirty rich kid who won't stop following me around. <laughs> He seems to be close friends with a gang leader at Sakura. Yeah, she's deep in thought. She built up a reputation as a tough guy. All the way back in middle school, actually. Every delinquent around here knows who he is. <laughs> the transfer, huh? You got the wrong uniform on, sweetheart. Oh, look, th that's... It's just because that damn four eyes made a mistake. I mean... Obviously. Don't want to go around wearing those girly skirts anyhow. But you are wearing a skirt, though. 
Seems kind of weird if you ask me. A transfer at this time of year? Maybe that's just how it happened for her. Or maybe she's trying to pull some shit. Hey, just lay off already. But why'd she come here of all places? Why here? Well... Recall? A few days ago. Found her. Go on then. I've been waiting for you. You're dismissed. I'd like to speak with her alone. Yuki Takamiya, 16 years old. A first year at Suzugamine Girls High School. Entered a boys' school and engaged multiple delinquents. Twelve of which were sent to the hospital. Holy shit. <laughs> precedes you. She got she got twelve dudes. I went to Nigakuri to settle a score. And somehow the cops managed to sniff me out. One of those dicks must have snitched. I went Oops, to Nigakuri and somehow one of those dicks. My bad. <laughs> you seem a little tense. Allow me to get to the point. We've taken notice of your particular set of skills. We'd like to work with you. Seriously? Any of those Kuri boys end up dead? Three had bone fractures, the others just bruises and scrapes. <laughs> That's too bad. Hmm. What a badass. Got something dude. <laughs> to say? They're the ones who laid their filthy hands on my friend. All I did was give them what they had coming. None of your damn business anyways. And by that, you mean selling out my friends? I'm not going to be your stooge, and I don't work with cops. Based. Go find some other sucker. Your father, Heita Takamiya, currently serving a sentence for the murder of a gang member. Yeah? So what? There have been attempts on his life by other inmates. Not surprising, since the man he killed was a gang leader. I imagine it's a matter of reputation for them. Your father has been assaulted twice, but he is alive. For now. <sighs> now, if we were so inclined, it would be quite easy to transfer him to a safer facility. Contingent on your cooperation, of course. What an asshole. God, I hate you already. He's behind bars for stabbing a Yakuza. Maybe he's nothing but a too-big gangster, but... He's the only real family I have. On to business, then. Are you familiar with Shikishima Industries? Publicly, they manufacture a wide range of products. Rockets, planes, trains, ships, even home appliances. Not so publicly, it seems they're also developing nuclear weapons. Oh no. We suspect they are colluding with another nation to do so. And what does that have to do with me? We began investigating and found that several minors are connected to these weapons. All of these children are of high school age and are being rounded up at a school affiliated with Shikishima. So they're using kids to make nuclear weapons? This shit sounds ridiculous. True. Shikishima. It's that company with all those commercials for TVs and fridges. So they're making weapons too? Is there any branches? Oh no, this is the prologue. There's not gonna be anything crazy. If you bastards got that much dirt on them, why don't you just bust into Shikishima yourselves? We'd prefer not to have this go public. And the less the police are involved, the better. Wait, if you're not the cops, then who the hell are you guys? We are a special investigations unit. Government established and affiliated. Some might They're call feds. us spies. I am director of the SIU and your superior. All right, so they're making weapons. But what do these kids have to do with it? 
I'm glad to see I've piqued your interest. Take a look at those documents on the table. It's a list of their names. That damn Four Eyes. He says there's some spy agency. It's short for Special Investigations Unit. They may not be cops, but they're honestly all the same to me. Before we get into the specifics of the job, do you have any questions for me? I don't think so. I already asked him stuff. Uh, class 1B, Iori Fuyusaka. Class 2A, Renya Goto. More class 1, Kisaragi, Karabe. <laughs> class 1C, Natsuno Minami. We need someone to investigate these students. And that someone is you, Yuki Takamiya. Not John. But why her? Not John, my childhood friend. Oh, hey, it's that girl. We went our separate ways in middle school. But we still kept writing to each other. She's the only person I really care about. <sighs> Who's this? Allow me to introduce you. This is Ryoko Shinonome. She is another undercover investigator, and your superior. Just as she did, you'll be transferring to Sakura High School. We'll handle the paperwork. Hey, pump your brakes, you old man. I haven't agreed to any of this shit yet. They got dirt on you too, Dopey? Is she the one? Yes, she is. Hey, I'm talking to you. She doesn't look like she knows much. Rude. <laughs> I can already tell I'm not gonna like you. <sighs> you have quite the abrasive personality. We're not finished. Do you accept your assignment? I don't give a shit about your assignment. <laughs> well then, I think it's safe to say we're not getting through to her. Don't worry, she will work with us. It's her destiny after all. My destiny! Two weeks in. No sign of her today, either. Where are you, Nachan? Oh, hi. Uh, Hello? Sure, I'll... Hey, you! Got a sec? You're in Class 1C. That right? Yes. Natsuno Minami's in your class, isn't she? Oh, yeah. She's been out for three days now. Have you heard anything? The teacher just said she was out sick. Did they hear from her directly? I don't know. Hmm. Sorry for bothering you. Stop moaning. Hi, Yori. Any news? <laughs> um, do you need something? Oh, no. Never mind. Miwa chan. Yori chan. Any news? Are they gonna talk? No one at the school seems there to know go. anything. No chance, okay. Uh, what should we do? Stop by Natsuno chan's house again? Those weird guys might still be there, though. 
Hey, you! <laughs> Got a sec? I heard you talking about Natsunomi Nami. Who are you? Hey, Takamiya, you're real close that's beside there. the point. I want to know what's going on with Natsuno. He's sneaking. Why hasn't she been coming to school? It sounds like she hasn't been at home either. We went to her house yesterday, but her mom just kept apologizing over the intercom. The police were there too. Were they really the police though? <sighs> Well, that's worrying. Thanks for letting me know. Nachon hasn't been at home either. Sorry, did I keep you waiting? And those cops. It's okay. Or Let's whatever they are. What were they doing there? Goodbye. What are you doing? What's your problem? You remember your orders, don't you? You're supposed to keep a low profile. Hmm. I can't recall. Maybe you've forgotten about your father, too. What did you say? <laughs> One more thing. Don't go looking for Natsunomi Nami. What? You mean... Those guys they thought were the police. They're agents with the SIU. In any case, Natsunomi Nami isn't your concern. She's a part of my assignment. So stay out of my way. Are we clear? Don't like it. Hey! Hold on! What could have happened to Nachan? I bet that four-eyed bastard has some answers. Time to do what I do best. Ring, ring. This is unacceptable. I thought I made it clear that you are not to contact me. I need to know what happened to Natsunomi Nami. And I know you have answers. Teenagers run away from home all the time. That's what the police say, but the school insists she's out sick. Looks like nobody can get their story straight. So which is it, huh? I'm not an idiot, you know. Your suspicions are not unfounded. But our investigation is still ongoing. I don't have a clear answer myself. We don't know where she is, or even if she's still alive. The evidence so far points to kidnapping. Who the hell would want to kidnap her? Shikishima? They could have done it without anyone realizing she was gone. There'd be no need to draw such attention to themselves. No. Someone else is behind this. And that's who Shinonome is looking for? <laughs> Someone at the school could be behind this. It's possible they are there even now. In any case, the situation is dangerous. I suggest you keep your nose out of it. Shinonome-kun has this under control. As for you, Takamiya-kun, you will continue to monitor the other students as instructed. Have I made myself clear? <laughs> Screw that. Good luck with that, bud. He doesn't give a hoot. Six mystery files. None of them are new, though. What do we get? Yuki. Wow, okay. Yuki Takimiya is a skilled Tsukiban girl, infamous across many schools as Takamiya of Suzu High. She's devoted to her friends, has a strong sense of justice, and is quick to get into fights. Natsuno Minami is a childhood friend of hers, and though they were separated for a while, she's still her best friend and one of the only people she can feel truly at home with. Tetsuya Ida, the head of SIU, blackmails her and asks her to infiltrate Juo Kurabe's high school. Su wow, they have a whole translator note in here. Sick. Sukeban is a term originating in the 1970s to describe delinquent girls, deriving from the combination of another slang term, suke, 
A now antiquated way to refer to refer to women and Bon from Boncho, which refers to a leader of a gang of delinquents. However, Sukebon was used to describe any girl that was a delinquent, not just the leaders. Nice. What else is new in here? SIU office. A room on the fifth floor of the government building in Aoi Ward. Tetsuya Ida's office. I don't have any mystery points. Alright, where do those events fit in? Nachan and Yuki-chan. Okay, so that was her first scene. After she transferred there because of the SIU. And then... Natsumi was gone. Is that after Natsumi got uh, time traveled? She was being chased. Yeah, and that's when they time traveled, right? She escaped from school and then got time traveled away. So she's still missing then. Okay. 